Yo, what's crack a folks? It's Justin Charnel here, and I'm just going to talk about like really the number one reason why you should stop using cold email templates. Um, just overall, especially uh, you know, business to business and business consumer is really difficult to to cold email because uh, can spam laws and, and, and GDPR and yada 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 all that riff raff. You probably go go down a really dark rabbit hole doing uh, business to consumer cold emails. So let's talk about stop using templates for cold business to business emails. Uh, there's there's multiple reasons. I guess the real the real number one reason is. By the time you get you who you 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 who is watching this video wondering why they shouldn't use a template, by the time you get your hands on somebody's template, yes, they crafted it. Yes, they tested it and it works. But they always leave off the third point, which is it's already been done to death, used and abused, and now it's tossed to the side of the road. By the time it hits your ears, it's dead. The method is dead. Um, you might think, well, what if they're in, what if they're in the calculator industry and I'm in the air freshener industry? You you think you're the first person that they they've told like by the time it's on YouTube or whatever, by the time it's put in a course, it's it, it it's dead, like knowledge. It's it's not dead, but it's already out there and open, and it's already been used and abused. Um, just kind of look into it like a, like a funnel, so to speak. They, uh, so so they have templates, right? By the time it gets to your ears, it's already gone through their like core group of homies, the the, the few guys that they keep around that, that they trade, they swap secrets with and whatnot. Uh, they get value from unilaterally. It's a, it's a, not a parasitic relationship, so to speak, but uh, mutualistic. They got benefits from both sides. So it goes through all their friends first. Their 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 core group of people, right? Like they got like eight people that they are in a mastermind group with that they talk to every day, and they all are in different industries, so they're not competing with each other, whatever. So then those like eight people are just tinkering with it and using it and doing it, doing it, doing it, doing it. And then once they kind of get sick of it, once it kind of gets dry and they can't really use it anymore, then it goes to like their, you know what, let's go the other way. That's their core group of homies. And then it goes to like their, 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 you know, like every single internet marketer has like this sales funnel that starts with like a, oh, just give me your email address. Oh, buy this $7 product. Oh, 67. Oh, 497. Um, and everything ends in seven because everybody follows what everybody else did, but nobody knows the actual, like, the study that was conducted uh, for ending in seven instead of nine or 99 online, whatnot. So these are, like, these are the, this is, like, homie. This is, like, his core group of friends, like, his actual, like, real tight group of people. And then it goes to, like, the little little mastermind group. The people that are paying, like, $3,000 just to talk to the guy once a fucking month. Um, he'll tell them, hey, you want to step your life up or step your business up? Send out this email. All right, so now it goes from one person doing it to eight, and I'm left-handed, I'm using my right hand, that's why it's really terrible, to eight people doing it. So now, oh, well, let's see, we got we got 40 people doing it, right? So now it's at that level. And you go down, you go down, I can keep going, go down, go down. And now it's on YouTube. When it by the time it gets on YouTube, you got all these people, all these people already used, abused, and completely just own the shit. It's own. It's a blog post. It's a blog post. It's on YouTube. It's in somebody's. It's on somebody's podcast. By the time it's free to hear, it's already been completely just blown out it's blown out and it's tired and people are tired of seeing it and it just it might work but by odds are it's not because people have seen it so many fucking times before so here's what you do and this okay i know this is about you know cold emails but this really applies to everything strategies with seo strategies with anything like marketing wise uh sales wise everything by the time it gets here the, the, the cat's out the bag. It's no longer something that's working for 
probably these people. By the time it reaches here, it's no longer for them. They've already included in their $7 ebook and their $47 course and their $577 course and their $3,007 uh, mastermind or whatever the hell. So now by the time it gets here, it's used, abused, and it's it's looking droopy, right? It's blown out. It's looking sloppy. It's like it's just the pizzas, the, all the cheese and toppings have run off. And it's just crust and, and some dried up tomatoes. So, what can you do with that information then? You don't just take that template or whatever the hell it is. Okay? We're, we're still related to cold business to business emails. You don't take that template and, oh, I'm just filling the blanks. Hey, you're going to sound like every other Joe Schmo watching that fucking video. What you need to do is take, you got template one here, template two, template through 20, you kind of look at them all and you, you if you want to be, if you're super visual, print them all out, lay them on a table and just look at them. See what the hell they got going on. See what the, like what, what, uh, what they have in common, what they exclude, what they include, how their, how their, um, their, their subject line is, how their heading is, how, how that first sentence is, how do the, what, like, what kind of, what do they have in common? What are their characteristics? And you go, okay, so. They do this here, this here, this here, this here. What if, do, 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 do you think a little bit? Let's try this. Do, 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 do. And you just, you, you, you take a little bit from each one. And you craft your own message. And this really applies to like, yeah, it's it really it, like biz, cold business, business email is a really good example. But I mean, it, it, it works in a lot of different uh different things you know if you're if you're building websites for the sole like purpose of making money if you're watching a youtube video on how to whatever interview affiliate marketing or something like that odds are the sh if they share a very specific tactic that they did it's probably not going to work because it's already been blown out like there there's things that i do that i won't share um like for social media uh, there, there are things, there are accounts that I have that are getting like millions of impressions and thousands of clicks to whatever link I throw in the tweet on Twitter. And I won't share that method because it's still working. When, when, by the time you see me put out a video that says how to drive unlimited traffic what, uh, on autopilot with Twitter for free, um, by the time that video comes out, the method is dead. And you can reference this video uh, because that's that's what it is. That's what that's what this whole game is. You're, you're you know, when you're buying information, when you're buying a course, when you're whatever. I know it's kind of a tangent from the original like SE or cold business business stuff, but you're buying a course, especially like SEO or some shit like that. By the time you actually like read it, look at it, by the time somebody creates it, by when the shit is outdated. All right. And by the time you get the free templates, the shit is already blown out. So, like I said, have your little swap, swipe files or whatever you want to call them. Take your little bits and pieces and figure out what they got going on and craft your own message. Because if you use a template, you're going to get template results, which are usually negative.